I haven't been back yet. I'm actually heading down in October. Um, I'm really excited. I'm excited to go back and, and, you know, I love New Zealand, so it's always a pleasure to, to revisit New Zealand. I mean, it, it still very much feels like a home, a second home to me. Um, and the opportunity to come back and, and work with largely the same crew and creative team and a number of the same actors is, um, it's really exciting. It feels like a, a giant family reunion in a way. It's, ex it, it's extremely close to the book. In fact, it's actually a, um, a flash forward in time. Um, you know, Frodo is not alive during the, the, the time period of The Hobbit. It's about 60 years before Frodo's birth, I think. Um, so ultimately, myself and Ian Holm, who played Bilbo in The Lord of the Rings, will have some scenes together <clears throat> um, that will precede the, the Hobbit time. Um, you know, Bilbo actually wrote the the hobbit in in a book um called there and back again a hobbit's tale and so i think there might be something to do with that book that he's writing um and yeah so it's it's very much keeping the integrity it, the, frodo does not exist within the context of the time period of the hobbit so to look younger well thankfully i mean i was 18 when we started um and i was about 22 when we were finished um I haven't aged that much. <laughs> uh, I, I'm sure if, if, it, if there was probably like a direct frame by frame reference, you'd see a difference. But I don't think, I think if I shave my facial hair and put the wig back on, I don't imagine that I will have changed too much.